Tanse, Selena Lawyer, Kasi Kasu. Hi, my name is Selena Lawyer. I'm the Aboriginal Programmer at the Musée Heritage Museum for the Arts and Heritage Foundation of St. Albert. Uh, this week is Métis Week and we are showcasing work of prominent Métis artists um, as part of our education space here in the museum. Some Métis artists base their, their artwork on beadwork, which is based on the floral patterns that Métis people are famous for. We're actually called the Flower Beadwork People by the Dakota Sioux, and um, it's one of the things that Métis people are well known for. One of my favorite artists is Christy Belcourt, and we are showcasing this piece that was made by her, Medicines to Heal Us. It is a wonderfully colorful piece that shows all of the different flowers and herbs that are used as medicine, but they're depicted in pointillism. So each of the little dots represents as if it were a little bead. So this is the work of Leah Dorian, who's a very well-known Métis artist as well. This is called the Pemmican Berry Series, and it reflects the importance of choke cherries in the life of Métis people. This is the work of Rihanna Lorenza Vard, who is a local artist, and it also reflects the pointillism, the dots that form the little the flowers. And she's also used that technique of sort of reflecting what it would have looked like if it was made with beads. Um, she's also used fish scales in her art here. I don't know if you can see them there, but she's incorporated fish scales to make little flowers as well. It's just, it's a, such a lovely little piece. So we encourage you to come on down to the museum and have a look at these pieces. And as well, you can check our blog at museeheritage.ca for more information about these artists and about their work. Thank you.